Hello everyone, welcome to Batches Exam Prep. So I am here again to give you one very important notification that NPCIL has announced bumper vacancy through the gate scorecard and the gate scorecard which are eligible is uh, gate 2021, 22, 23. So the last three year gate score are acceptable and this is especially for all the branches that is your mechanical, civil, electrical, electronics, instrumentation. So all these branches are eligible for this particular post and there are huge number of vacancies. So uh, let's uh, discuss uh, the detail of this particular notification. So uh, that is if you will see this is gate 21, 22, 23 for executive trainee post. And the last date of the receipt of online application is 28th of April and the starting date would be 14th of April, right? So, uh, let's see the important detail uh, that is, uh, yeah, so what are the number of vacancies? So, overall vacancies are, backlog vacancies are also there in the current vacancy. So, overall 325 vacancies are there out of which the mechanical is having 123, chemical 50. Electrical 57, Electronics 25 and Instrumentation 25 and Civil 45. So there is a very good number of vacancy for the electrical students and electronics students also and along with that instrumentation. So these are uh, almost uh, we have uh, 127 number of posts for the double EEC because if you have given the uh, gate from the other department suppose you are EEC and you have given the from the instrumentation of your from double EF you have given from the EC or IN then also you can apply for these number of posts if you have got the good rank in the instrumentation then also you are eligible. So let's see what are the details or oh, this is the uh, display uh, disable category so if you have any of this then you can check it once uh, what are the uh, criteria for the PWD students right. And uh, the starting date of the application is 11th of April and the last date is 28th of April in the evening 4 o'clock and the payment will be done in between 11 to 28 April and the total payment will be 500 for this application. The discipline advertisement is mechanical and the mechanical students can apply from mechanical production, chemical can apply from chemical, electrical can apply from electrical and double E that is electrical and electronics both and if you are electronics student then you can apply from electronics, electronics and communication, telecommunication, electronics and instrumentation, electronics and control and electrical and electronics also and instrumentation also instrumentation, instrumentation and control and instrumentation and electronics and civil students only apply can from the civil. So uh, you can read this if you have the other uh, particular gate scorecard suppose you are from electrical and if you have EC or IN scorecard also and if you have good rank in that particular uh, discipline then you can apply you can read these three paragraph which is related about the if you have other qualified gate scorecard and uh, now if we go through the a date or as relaxation of the age so here you can see the table and this is for the age relaxation if you have any category like SC, SP, OBC or PWD then what will be the age relaxation that you can get from here right so this is the age relaxation table now coming to the selection procedure okay the selection procedure would be completely based on the interview and uh, they will shortlist you on the basis of gate scorecard but there will be no weightage on the gate scorecard in the final selection. In the final selection you will be having a uh, completely weightage on the interview performance okay and they will call you up to the ratio of 1 raised to 12. So if there are 25 vacancies so they will call 25 multiplied by 12. So overall they will call in this way uh, so we have 300 course suppose so they will call around 3600 3, students approximately right so the uh, monthly stipend will be 55000 during the training period there will be one year training after that they will give you the final selection the interview will be held on the mumbai and uh, these are the different allowances you will get incentives employee benefits miscellaneous facilities uh, loans advancements retirement benefits so that is very good good uh, uh, overall uh, systematic structure and there is a bond for the approximately uh, 6,78,000 and for the 3 year. 
okay at least 3 years after success full completion of training so approximately 4 year you can say and the selection procedure as i told you uh, let's zoom it so the selection procedure is here you can see they will call you up to 1 is to 12 on the basis of gate 21 gate 22 and gate 23 score card and uh, these will be the all the candidates will be having the equal weightage in according to the gate score card if, if you are having the uh, suppose two students are having the same gate score card then both will be called for the interview okay so equal weightage will be given for 21 22 and 23 score so there is no normalization kind of thing here and the final selection yes to so the final selection as we discussed that is completely based on the personal interview and subject to the medical fitness and reserve will have the 70% weightage and other category students will have 60% weightage in the interview and the rest will be in the medical and uh, after this if this is the how you, if you are suppose having the btech percentage so how much percentage is eligible so uh, you can check here if you have 55% 60% 65% then in the conversion how they will convert in the respective cgpa like that you can see this particular table also what will be the requirement a 10th standard passing score card school leaving certificate that is tc mark sheets indicating date of declaration of result final degree so final year students are also eligible if you are already working in some uh, government organization then you need a no objection certificate okay and uh, this is traveling allowances you will get for uh, attending the interview that is third ac train ticket you will get and the medical fitness the appointment of the selected candidates as executive training will be subject to the found medically fit by the authorized medical officer at npcil and the interview will be held on mumbai as i said how to apply so this is how you have to apply the you have to register you can visit the website of npcil career path career section and there you will get this pdf and you can read this pdf and the detail of everything like a uh how a signature is required the picture is required the what will be the size standard size or uh, what are the other documents required at the time of interview etc etc everything is given and no nothing has to be sent in the office of the npcil do not send any of the documents application form to the npcil for before interview until they ask they, they don't send any document just you have to fill the all the documents online only okay uh that is all the details you have got the online registration process consists of following steps so these steps you can follow to register yourself in this particular uh, vacancies okay so i am not going into detail of that this is just a informative video that the uh, npcil has announced the huge number of vacancies so you can just uh, fill this if you have very good score card okay so this is all about this and just go through the general condition also once uh, all the criteria is given so before filling the form go through all the uh, general conditions and eligibility criteria uh, before that don't fill until you uh, read this particular document because you have 10 days time this will start from 11th of april so uh, you have 10 days time go through it completely uh, and if you have any doubt then post the comment in the comment section uh, then i will uh, give you the reply in the comment section itself if you have any doubt filling during the filling of this particular uh, form okay so thank you for watching this uh, particular notification video and if any video comes a uh, notification comes again then i will come with another video thank you